Jim, this, uh, this must be really sad news, especially in um, Northern Ireland. What are your memories of uh, Lord Trimble? Well, first of all, morning, ladies. Yeah, it's, uh, I, I watched the news last night and I heard the breaking news coming on and, and I, I sort of wonder, was it true? Uh, and unfortunately it is. Uh, David Trimble leaves a, a legacy of, of, of important uh, direction and focus for us through the, the Good Friday Agreement, which ultimately at the beginning we didn't support as a party and we had differences of opinion. Uh, but I, I do think that David Trimble, for many of us, set the focus, the direction and probably the political progress for the for the future. For the last 25 years, for instance, uh, it's very clear to me uh, that uh, that politics has moved in the direction where we need to be. I probably never had as many discussions with David Trimble as others had, but whenever I became the Member of Parliament back in 2010, I had the opportunity to meet him on many occasions and he was in the House of Lords at that time. We had discussions with chats with even cups of tea and, and, and meals together. And I always found him that perhaps he and I uh, collectively uh, were moving to the same political opinion on issues. Uh, we probably had much discussions about the, the Brexit agreement because that's where I think uh, his focus and my focus were over the last period of time. But he was a, an immense character, immense character, uh, a, a man of great stature, of courage, he certainly was a visionary, and, and, and that's something that I would say him as. Um, and I, I do believe that um, history will be most kind to him because of what he has done over the last few years and the direction he has uh, sent Northern Ireland in, which I think many people today, Northern Ireland's a better place for his work that he has done. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's almost hard to remember now that we saw such devastating troubles taking place in Northern Ireland, you know, 35 years ago. And he put his own security and the security of his family at risk by pursuing getting a, a, a peace treaty drawn up, didn't he? Oh, he certainly did that. Uh, so I've lived through all the troubles uh, um, and, and I understand exactly what has happened. David Trimble put his life in the line and his family's Daphne and the children's life in the line, uh, as, as many did across the whole of the province. I, I think he was focused on what was achievable. Uh, and and uh, with that goal in mind, he focused upon the goal uh, and, 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 and led Northern Ireland in the direction where he... Uh, wanted us to be and where today I think we are better for. Uh, w w did he live danger? Uh, he certainly did. Uh, but many others lived that same danger. Uh, and I think we're immensely in debt to David Trimble for all he's done.